hello my friendly shoppers and welcome back. This is Gina and today we are back shopping at World Market. I also call this Cost Plus. It's an old name that they used to have and well I think they still carry that as well but I still refer to this as Cost Plus. But let's check out World Market. They have some of their Valentine's. $3.50 of Valentine pasta. Oh I love these type of mats. Those are always so pretty. Now this is really interesting. Vintage Valentine's. It's a pack of 15 and aren't those cute? Take a look. Oh, the kitties and the little doggies. These are so cute. And even includes the envelopes. $15, okay, it's not too bad of a price. It makes them each a dollar, but these are so adorable. Oh, I love all the kitty ones. Those are cute. Now I'm not gonna, I'm not going to grab any. I honestly, I'll probably send like a couple of cards out to like a couple of family members, and that's about it. So but I'm gonna keep going. This wood heart. Oh, this is actually perfect for keys. $15. I would use this all year long. And this little ceramic dish. How much is that? $8.99. Those are cute for desserts. And this little heart plate. And it's also ceramic. That is $8.99. See, I would use this to serve my daughter like breakfast on Valentine's. She gets a kick out of those things. And a little heart paperweight. And this is pretty. Let's see how much that is. 20, $25. Okay, not too bad. And then all the chocolates. Now, I know World Market is not the most budget-friendly place, but they always have so much fun stuff. Hey, look at these. Valentine Day fortune cookies. Okay, six dollars. And then you have the Lent Lindor dark strawberry chocolates for eight dollars for a bag. And these little heart marshmallows for seven. And all these fun little treats. Not too bad. And let me know in the comments below. Do you do anything special for Valentine's for your spouse or for your kids? look at these. Now, I used to love gummies. They don't taste the same as they used to, but oh, I used to love the cherry and the Coca-Cola ones. Those were my favorite. And like over a year ago, I found the cherries and it, was, it didn't taste the same. It didn't taste as good as I remember it. And then the little heart chocolates. Those are $4. Junior mints, $2. Those are cute. Oh, they're Shape of Hearts. That's cute. The Big Hunk. Well, I don't see a price for that. I've actually never had that candy bar before. Sweethearts. Now, when I was younger, I used to love these. And I, they don't taste the kids like another one of those. They just don't taste the same. But those were always fun to get. Now, I don't know what this is. Is it champagne? Is it wine? Is it fruit juice in a fancy bottle? There's no label, no price. It just says like, I love you across there. And the little hearts, it's cute. I just have no idea what it is. Now for $11, here's some more, a Valentine collection of chocolates. Now, one of our favorite places obviously is Seas Candy, for, that we go there for chocolates. And it's always, it's always special. It's, those are our favorite. And But my husband and I, one of the things we like to do on Valentine's Day, I don't know what it is, but we just get a kick out of it, is that we drive by Seas Candy and see how long the line is. <laughs> and it never fails how long that line is on Valentine's. Now for $20, these are ginger snap cookies and this beautiful tin. Oh, that is so pretty. And the tin alone, I just absolutely love it. And these honey spoons, 
rose honey. Interesting. Seven dollars. Looks like there's three in them in there. And more of the chocolates. Now these little hot cocoa chocolate bombs. The six dollars. These are so fun, but I got one like this last year, and it, when we put it in, it was like waxy on top, so it didn't taste that good. <laughs> and then for $2.50, marshmallow toppers and the Merci chocolates. And then, okay, let's kind of go with the Kit Kats, $8.99. These are so fun. I mean, look at this one, let's have a tea party. Milk Tea Kit Kat. That sounds actually really good. These are a little pricier, $8.99. There's only a few of them in the bag. Oh, the matcha tea. My daughter would love that. She loves that matcha tea. And the Poxy Coconut. Ooh, that sounds really good. These are $3.99. And then Banana and Chocolate. And then Almond Crush. Those are fun. And then now, this is what my daughter just gets a kick out of these. Now, these are a little bit pricey. Obviously, I mean, she loves like My Melody and Hello Kitty. Hey, look how these are the dry noodles, all the little ramen noodles. And these are a little, these are a little pricey. But just, I think it's just more of the fun of it. And what is that? Is that soda of water for $2.50 and then another kitty pop? Now, of course, I like to see fun coffee. I have I have never seen these before. But the cans are just cute. You have the vanilla coffee, the cappuccino, this is coffee with the milk. And three dollars is actually the average price. Now these little shopping baskets and shopping carts are super adorable. That is cute. I almost need one. They're $16.99, so that maybe not. <laughs> so let's keep going. Now I love seeing all of the European chocolates and the cookies. Now this is after eight orange and mint. Oh, my husband would love those. We do like those after eight minutes. No price. And okay, and I've seen, I remember seeing these in England. Four dollars. And these are always kind of little fun little treats. Now, these are actually really good. I had a friend who bought those. Those are five. And the Cadbury, yes. Crunchy melts with Oreo. Gonna move that back over here. These are $5.99. Oh, chocolate chip, a little chocolate cream in there for $6. Oh, here's the other after eights. Those are $8. Those are really good. And then here's that honey. Now, I have showed this at Costco. Costco has, okay, so this little one half is $14. This is actually really good. Now, honeycomb like this does not expire. Just don't get any moisture on it. And don't store it in the fridge. So Costco had two of those for $25, and then these are $20 each. So can you imagine if you bought two of them, that'd be $40. So this is, so Costco does have the good deal, but if you really want to want, all you have to do is just scrape the, the wax caps off of it. Oh, it is so tasty with cheese and crackers. I love honey and cheese. There's something about that. And oh, I love all these little fun. Here's another. Honeycomb. This one costs a little bit less. It is definitely smaller, but yum. And this is one of the things I do love about Cost, well, cost Plus World Market. I, I love all these unique items and all the fun food. The little syrups and the different honeys. What is, what is down here? It's some jams. Those all the different honeys. And we love having a nice little variety of honey. Now what is this? Vegan cocoa spread for $5.50. You got your Nutella. You got your Biscoff for $6. Yeah, nice little variety of these. And so... 
these little jams to get strawberries. So these are $5.99. Costco has the Cherry Reserves, a much larger jar for $8.99. But if you don't go through that much and you just like to have different flavors, this is this is probably the best deal I've seen of those. I love all these little fun little fruit spreads. And then the scones. Now these scones, I have used these packages before. Now I do make them from homemade, from scratch. But sometimes I just want something really quick. These are $5.99. These, these used to be like $3.99. But these do make some good scones. There's gluten-free now, the cinnamon chip. I get the plain just because I can add different jams to it and then I like to add like the cream and I make my own like cream for the scones. I do a sour cream and then I add a little bit of sugar and then oh now this is the this is the coffee that we use. Now it's $13.99 Target actually sells it for $8.99 and a lot of times they have 35% off the sale. When they have that 35% off, that's what I stock up. So Target does have a really good price. I know Target can get a little pricey nowadays, but and even the Illy. So both of these Italian coffees is what we use because we do love a good, strong coffee. And then they have all of these fun little syrups. Eight, and these are $8.99. Yeah, these used to be a lot less. But I, I know everything is really has gone up in price. But all of they have so many different flavors. Because I remember just seeing vanilla, hazelnut, and caramel. <laughs> and now it's all these different ones. And this was the place that I would get this. Now, they always have fun little sodas. This is $1.75. All I see is like Blood Orange, which is one of my favorites. And there's that lime. I may try, I may grab a couple of these. Now, I'll tell you, I love these and I love them for the bottles. Look at that. That bottle, we reuse them too. We'll clean it up, we'll take the labels off, and we use, reuse them and make our own like little syrups. And so, I mean, this one, look at blood orange grapefruit. That sounds really tasty. And this is always fun. Ginger beer, the cherry cola. Pink ginger. Ooh. Now, we have seen this brand. We saw this at Costco as well. It was a pack of 12. Okay, this is $6.49. So it was a pack of 12. I want to say it was like for $12 or $15. I can't, I can't really remember. But a lot of my viewers were telling me that it's actually really good. So it's a nice little selection. So everybody, well, thank you so much for coming along to Cost Plus with me. I hope you are doing well. So take care and I'll talk to you later.